and Miller. Ready. You ready to fight? All right, so here we go, round one. I can barely hear myself think in this arena right now. Two of the most dominant, well-rounded fighters in this division. I mean, these guys are the best of all of mixed martial arts. They can do everything when they're locked inside of the octagon. I'm so excited to watch the highest level of MMA on display tonight. Miller gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Ooh, blocks the shot. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Good finish the strike. Oh! Beautiful strike. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Lands the left punch now, followed by a right. Just out of range with the big right hand. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure He's not taking those damages strikes up top. Ooh, what a punch. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. He's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Trying to stay in this fight. All right, so he lands another hook there. He's fallen in love with that strike, but when you continue to land at this type of clip, why get away from it? Why not? Why not fall in love with a punch that can't miss? He cannot miss with this hook. He's doing a good job of setting it up, fading out his jab, and then throwing the hook around his opponent's high guard. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, big knee there. That one landed clean. Some nice back and forth action here. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Left hand punch with the clinch. One, two there by Miller. Oh, hook to the head by Lee. No, no, no. Up and the left hand. Continuing to go to the head. Right hook to the body. Just unable to quite find that range. Right on the button. Oh, he lands a hook there, DC. That was one of his more significant lands of the fight. He can land that strike over and over again. This round, you want to keep mixing things up. Use your punches, use your knees, use your kicks. I want to see you work back. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to... Ready to fight? Ready. All right, let's get to round two. Oh, nice double hit, yes. Oh, man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. A couple hammer fists there for good measure. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound starts. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Well, if you're sick of us dropping that word hook, don't shoot the messenger because he throws and more often than not, he lands just like he did in the previous round. Found a home for it again. Here. Found a home for it again. And if I'm him, I'm continuing to go to the well. His opponent has not shown an ability to stop him. 
Jones. Watch a good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy, and not just busy, but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing a fantastic job. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. Miller's attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. Close guard. And they both stand up. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Well, if you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the tie clinch. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He is a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee-knee and then try to land a big one to the head. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Welcome. Oh! 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 Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the punches and everything landing. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Lee gets the tie clinch here. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh! And they separate. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too, because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, he landed that kick to the out. He turned his entire body into that uppercut and it landed exactly as he was hoping for. Listen up. You've been here before. All right? That was nothing. You're going to go out there, stay on the outside, and take your time. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? And he switches his stance yet again. He lands a big knee to the body. And they separate. Blocks the shot. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Just out of range with that right hook. And they separate. Big powerful punch. Oh, there, DC, he is officially rocked. A big, massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Just over three minutes to go. so aggressive with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality. So if you're the referee, you got to protect the fighter, and I thought he did a good job of doing just that. Another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. All right, the official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen.